you to RoboForm Password Manager for sponsoring this video. What is good, everybody? Another vlog today. I'm actually excited because I just got out of my interview for SEO, which is a mentor mentee program where basically I would mentor a student in the inner city of one of New York City's five boroughs. I think the interview went well. I don't find out whether or not I got accepted to be a mentor until August slash beginning of September, but I think it went well. Today, I don't know if I set the camera right here. Today, I don't have a lot of work to do. Our sprint actually just ended. So now I'm gonna be working on some new tasks. I'm actually really excited because my desk setup is so different. I'm gonna have a whole dedicated video talking about my upgrades. It was time, y'all. I'm about to go to the coffee shop. I've been making pour over recently and then just not drinking coffee altogether. But today I'm gonna treat myself to a nice iced caramel macchiato. One con that I've noticed as a remote software developer is that I get bored being within the same four walls pretty much every weekday. So that's why I come into coffee shops, going to play basketball with the homies and doing other things just to get out of the house make a huge difference because if you're a little bit extroverted and you like being around people, it can be kind of draining being in the same four walls all the time, just behind a computer screen. Okay, the next thing that I have to do is stand up. I got a stand up meeting in literally one minute. Before we continue this video, I want to take a moment to talk about RoboForm and how they can make your life easier. If you're using a password book or sticky notes, I know it's a lot of you sticky notes folks out there. It's time for an upgrade to more securely save your precious information from passwords to credit cards, addresses, bank account information, and the list goes on because let's face it, our whole lives are digital now. The features I personally like the most when it comes to RoboForm is for one, I can pick a super secure, unique password for all of my sites, which is really important because reusing the same password over and over again is just a terrible idea. I also can honestly save a lot more time now using RoboForm because with one click of a button, I can autofill my credit card information and address, which can help me beat those bots when I'm trying to cop a new hype release, whether it's a hat or a pair of sneakers. Most importantly, RoboForm uses industry standard encryption for all your data to give you a peace of mind that your information is secure. I know some of you all are like, doesn't my browser already do all this? It does, but not very well. RoboForm will log you into all of your devices and browsers, regardless of the operating system you're using. RoboForm is super easy to get started, so you can have it up and running in minutes. They even have a special deal for my viewers where you can save 30% off your RoboForm everywhere subscription by using my link. That's just $16 a year. Go to www.roboform.com slash Jossie or click the link down in the description box below to sign up today. Thank you again to RoboForm for sponsoring this video. The first pro I think about when it comes to working remotely is the flexibility to travel with taking minimal vacation. Honestly, I can work from anywhere. When you work remotely, you can work out of an Airbnb, a hotel, you can move all together. Also, when it comes to traveling, you can travel after work hours. Like I usually head out of work around like 5 p.m. virtually. So that means I can take a flight at like 6 p.m. And as long as I'm able to log in by like 9.30 a.m. Eastern time, I'm good to go. And I can even take like a couple hours off of work just so I can travel to whatever destination we're headed. The other really nice thing is since my job is based on the East Coast time zone, I can work in the West Coast, but I can get off work significantly earlier, which almost makes it seem like 
your own vacation. Other really nice perk to working remotely that's a major pro is spending more quality time with your loved ones, your family, and your friends. During my lunch breaks or any kind of break, it's really cool because I have a few friends that live in the same apartment complex, so we'll work out together, maybe go grab lunch and some coffee, take a walk because we live like 15 minutes, like a 10 minute walk, 15 minute walk to the lake. And of course, I've been able to spend a lot of quality time with my wife. I always tell her like, I don't know what it's gonna be like when we go back in office because I'm so used to waking up and us both being here, making breakfast, making coffee for her and myself. And I really appreciate that quality time. If you're lucky enough to get a fully remote job, you can take advantage of having a salary that's based in a much more expensive city. Let's say your job is based out of New York City, but you live in like Austin, Texas, somewhere, or maybe somewhere in Ohio, and you have that New York City area salary living in a much cheaper area. You can do so many things with that extra money. You can utilize it to build your emergency fund, invest in stocks or crypto, put the extra cash, towards a trip or you can just become a sneaker at it like me honestly mentioned the biggest con when i was at the coffee shop which was tired of seeing the same physical location all the time like getting up walking from your bed and or your bedroom and then coming to like whatever space you work in hopefully you have a desk set up and you're not still working off a tv tray or coffee table or your lap I find myself overworking myself sometimes because it's so easy to access the technology and just work in general if I'm working from home through my laptop. It's so much easier to just like, all right, let me just write some code for a little bit. And you find yourself writing code from 10 p.m. to 1 a.m. Sometimes I feel like if I'm not productive, seven or eight hours out of the day, then I wasn't productive at all. Even though, let's just keep it real. When we were in office, no one is 100% productive. How many walking meetings have we had and coffee runs have we had and just sidebar conversations that turn into like an hour of being unproductive. In my mind, I don't find those things unproductive. I think that's a healthy way of working. 40 hours is such an old way. That's such an old traditional way of viewing how long people should work. I'd also be lying to say if it wasn't a con, it's a con slash pro. But you know, <laughs> being steps away from the couch and your TV can be a con. It's so easy to just take like a 20 minute nap turns into 45 minutes or just getting distracted with all the other things that you have accessible to you in your crib. But I personally think it balances itself out because there are those days and nights where you're working five to 10 hours more, oh, you know, during that work week because you have a lot of work to do. So it balances itself out. I personally love the idea of hybrid work. I think it's great. I think it's the future hybrid and remote work. I think it's the future. I personally think the best situation work-wise is allow your employees to decide if they want to come into office and then give them the flexibility to decide which office they want to, to go to. So the office isn't like this space where you have dedicated designated areas for you to, or dedicated desks for you, but you just, you know, dock your laptop to a monitor and you can sit wherever. I think that flexibility is better. I think we have a long way until we get to that point and major companies start adopting that and it becomes normal. But I'll be moving to the New York City area in October. I'm really excited. I'll be working in like a hybrid type of way. So yeah, that concludes this video. I hope you all enjoyed it. Give it a thumbs up if you're still here. Subscribe to the channel for more content like this. Thank you again to RoboForm for sponsoring this video. And as always, have a blessed rest of your week. I'll see y'all soon. Peace.